this is the perfect example of the you know to go along to get along because you saw your friend or your friend told you what they did and how they got away with it uh, that don't mean that if you do the same thing that don't mean that you're gonna get away with it that just means that the person your friend did it to learned something so that means the next time somebody tries that they're gonna handle it differently and they're gonna be ahead of you yeah more like 10 steps ahead of you just like this individual found out in this video hey man if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you like share subscribe leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you think about this video in the comments with that said let's get into this one Uh oh. Can you imagine the cops walked in? <laughs> oh! <laughs> gotcha. <laughs> gotcha. Oh! <laughs> Oh, shit. Why am I inside the store? Like, why are you locked the doors over there? I ain't my phone. Alright, I'm gonna call the cops for this investigation. You're gonna give me my screen back, or you're gonna go home. Which one is it? Because he's gonna get his friend, his friend, and I'm probably running home. Wow, you see how dangerous kids are? <laughs> Whoa! That's blink lying. Do you know I was scared? I wouldn't call my mom and tell my mom something totally different than what happened. Knowing this man probably got it recorded. No, I'm not caught moms. No, yes, sir, here's the phone back. But it goes to show you how comfortable she feels calling her mom about the situation and lying. Unbelievable, right? That's like the nerve. Like she did nothing wrong. You think my screen? All you have to do is give me the phone. Let me take the screen off, and I'll let you go. You just heard me, honey. Hmm. You just heard me, honey. Hmm. Yeah. Give me the phone. Give me the phone back. Hmm. Give me the phone back. Hmm. Give me the phone. Back. Huh? Give me the phone, back. The phone, me the phone. I'm gonna take the screen off and put your old screen back on and let you go. That's it. Oh! A customer tried to run away with a with a phone screen that I uh, repaired for her. No, I did not try to run away. Stop lying. I got you on video. Now she's threatening me to get somebody over here to shoot me. Yeah. She's a liar. Disgusting. Despicable behavior. Despicable. Oh, guys, she said she didn't try to run away. You know what? Let's rewind that footage right back. Let's go. From Sharika Jackson, it's Shakari and Sharika. Man, that totally looks like you were running, like you was on a track meet. You were hauling ass out of there. Yeah, you were running. And all I told her is to give me the phone, let me take the screen off, and I'll let her go. But she's getting people up, sent over here so they can shoot up the store. Ma. The oh, phone mom's phone is here. She Mom. tried to run out of the store. And I told her, I told her, give me the phone, I'll take the screen off, and we can be done with this. But she wasn't having it. How much is the phone for? The screen is 125. Pimpy, you only charged me with $75 for my phone. She has an XR. I got an 11. Or 11. Hey, that's what I'm saying. She didn't charge my other team hard enough to get that much. The screen for the 1200 is 200 You know, you didn't charge me when you fixed my phone. They didn't charge me that. You must have got insurance or something. No, you don't have insurance. What do you mean? You must have got insurance. So why did you go to insurance? I don't know. All she has to do is give me the phone back and I can take the screen off and we're done. <laughs> so, what difference would it have made the price of the phone? She still tried to run away with the phone without paying, ma'am. You're going to pound this all wrong. Wrong. She had the nerve to call you, knowing what she did. That means in her mind, she knows her mama is going to back her up. That's what that is, guys. That's all that is. You're 
Guys heard it right I told you keep saying that this TikTok wave man you heard what you said right the friend did the same thing recorded put it on TikTok my boy learned <laughs> he was prepared this time I'm falling for that trick twice second third none of that he learned the first time and that's all it took man the nervous so angry she is imagine how you gonna be so angry Knowing that you're lying. You almost got that man in trouble. Could have gotten that man hurt for your lies. Deception. Can you imagine somebody came up there and did something to that man? And then the footage came out. Imagine how, how you're going to feel inside. The way she was talking, she said, it's all like he's trapping her in there. I'm telling you, man, this generation is dangerous. Without accountability, respect, loyalty, integrity, morals, without none of that, we are in serious trouble. Look what she does. You heard what the mom decided out, out of her own mouth. She almost came up there and did something stupid. All because her daughter was straight up lying. And she had a serious face too while lying. But the mom did came up there and addressed that wrong. She comes down, it doesn't, it doesn't matter the price. Your daughter, you put to come down and try to get both sides of the story. Your daughter literally tried to run. Why would he just lock the door on you? That, that's to have that's to hang out with you. Man, people really are dangerous, man. That's why I say, man, be careful who you associate yourselves with, man. Because she wanted to follow her other friend. Thinking in her mind, it's going to go like how it went with her friend. No, man, it don't work that way in life. Some people, if all it takes for them to learn is one time. And he learned one time. That's why he was prepared this time. We're living in some dangerous times, man. In some scary, dangerous times. The youths, this TikTok, this phone thing, it, it has some type of hold on their mind and the 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 mentality. Like it takes them away from reality. It, it's scary, man. It's like that's their everything. Like without that phone, it's like the world comes crumbling down on them. They can't survive out it. The mom was wrong how she came in and approached that man. But I didn't I didn't like how she was cursing at, 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 at how she was cursing and carrying herself. I know she was upset. But at least she still tried to put her daughter in her place. But I'm already seeing, man. Give it a little while. Maybe maybe next week. Next month. That talking to your daughter face like that could turn into something very physical. I'm already seeing it. The when the daughter kind of I back a little bit, I'm I'm already seeing it. I'm already seeing it, man. I'm not sure what the father is. 
because you can see it, man. It, it will it will get physical. And you don't want it to get to that. I'm going to leave you guys with this story right here, man. The times we're living in is scary. When you know your kids have a problem, don't sugarcoat it. Don't look over it. Don't sweep it under the rug. Address it. Get them help. Get them therapy. Get them someone to talk to. Address this type of problem before it becomes out of control. I'm pretty sure you guys saw the young man from Chicago. Right? He was all over the news. I think he was, what, 22, 23 years old? God, he took his entire family's life. Eight people in the house. Yep. Mom, auntie, uncle, his sisters. Took everybody's life. Keep in mind, that was his family. Now, keep in mind, you guys heard the names I mentioned. There was not one mention of the father. And, shoot, they already had warnings because he did stuff in the past. He has a record. Nobody addressed it. And look what it ended up doing to all of them. He took all their lives. That young man needed help. I'm not sure if they tried to give him the help, but it was more than help. That's what I'm starting to believe now. People have to start believing in demons. Spirits. Because there's no way for you to explain these type of situations. You mean your whole family? That goes beyond mental health. All we could do is pray for individuals like this and hope they get the right help or the right treatment before it becomes out of hand. Mom, you got a ticking time bomb on you. Address that behavior right now. If dad is somewhere around, get him involved. It might be too late, but... But it's better now than never. All right? She's a dangerous, she's a dangerous teen, man. Dangerous as they come. Hey, man, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure you like, share, subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. And let me know what you think about this video in the comment. You guys honestly believe she didn't try to run with that phone. She just ran to go to the car to get the rest of the money. What are you talking about? He shouldn't trap her in there like that. Like mom said, he was charging too much. A few extra dollars. She got to cheap up the block. He's ripping them off, man. Until then, I'll catch you guys the next one. Peace out. You guys have a blessed day.